Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, I'll show you how to hand pollinate bottle guards to get more produce. Friends, this is a bottle guard creeper and I'm sure most of us face flower drop problems in bottle guard. And many of you have asked me in my other video on bottle guard that there are lots of flowers blooming on the plant but it's not turning into mature bottle guard. So today I am going to discuss all about it and I'm sure you'll get answers to all your questions regarding this. So first of all I'll show you its male and female flowers and they both bloom on the same plant. Guys its flowers bloom by late evening or night and in white color and they get closed by morning. This is a male flower while the other one with small fruit on its back is female flower which turns into mature bottle guard only if it gets pollinated by moths, bees, ants etc. And if this process doesn't take place then the female flower doesn't turn into a mature fruit. So now I will show you the hand pollination process how you can hand pollinate it. And friends, for pollination, be it natural or we do it manually, there has to be male and female flowers both. It can be from the same plant or from two different plants. So for hand pollination, you can take any brush and insert into the male flower so that pollens can stick to the brush. I hope you can see on the tip of brush and then dab it into the female flower. This way the pollens get transferred from male flower to the female flower and then repeat the process for two to three times. And now I'll show you how it looks after 3-4 days. Its size will start increasing. That means the hand pollination was a success. So friends, give it a try and let me know your experiences. And I will see you in a new video. Bye-bye.